Hi guys, we're going to react to Big Nate Means Part 4. Sorry if this thumbnail is so blurry. I don't know how to make it better on iMovie. Let's get started! What a fiasco. You interrupted us before I could find out if Jenny's still going out with Greg. Not only that, only Jenny saw with her own eyes that you're afraid of cats. I'm not afraid of cats, <laughs> just like that. I I'm afraid of cats. Remember the other day when I scared away that dog with a blast on my trombone? Yeah, well, wouldn't that work on cats? Maybe finally I found a way to deal with my fear of felines. Well, now, see your chance. Look, aha, look, cats, hold on, stay with them, stay where you are. <laughs> Go. It's though to blow affected lie when your lips are trembling. It's even tougher to that climb a tree for the... A trombone. What's up? I'm trying to teach Spitchy to chase cats. Looks like it's working. Not really. Tag. If they start playing Marco Polo in the, in the wedding pool, I may be ill. Fly Wrong. to Nate. If he catches it, we win. What the? What is he doing? Juggle, 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 nap, juggle, juggle. That's what you call a suckage catch. My uncle is killing me. What you seem to have trouble understanding, Spitzy, is the nature of dog catch relationship. Look, a cat. Do you see a cat? What the you do? The no, 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 no. There goes the cat. Get a Spitzy. Fish now, fish now. This is not going well. It was funny how Nate said no nine times. They were fighting. I thought they were having. Is the nature of the dog cat relationship. And Nate's plan is not even working at all. My is stopped by Olio. He's going on a business trip. He'll be gone a week. He asks if you're willing to take care of the spitzy for two dollars a day, and I said you'll be happy to. I gotta get a new agent. Have fun, you two. <laughs> Sorry, there's something I left. Make a basket, win a prize. I tried. Yeet. Pff. Hey. Busted. Crack. <laughs> Oh, I'll go for a hole? I can't move! Nate, catch it! Whip! Yes, what a grab! He's tugged up! Oh my god, baseball's a cool game. No, it's not! Zow! <laughs> Escape velocity! Oh no, Nate, be careful. Uh, are you going to eat your cereal? Eventually. I don't have to go to school, so I don't have to rush through my breakfast. I can take my time. Sure, my cereals can get to think soggy, but who cares? I like soggy cereal. Just my eating soggy till Labor Day. Ah, summer. But. Alright, people. We're going to spend a few minutes on geography. Just let me pull down the map and... I hate prank day. Alright, people, enough of this prank day nonsense. It's time to growl glam. Growl glam for you, Mrs. Godfrey. Ah, you must be Mrs. Godfrey. Ahem. <laughs> me, 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 me. <laughs> See you in <laughs> September. Wipes. <laughs> to be honest, um, I feel like that's April Fool's, but it's not even April Fool's. But, uh, that is kind of a funny picture. Next one. Jump, sprung, zoing. Couldn't you just grab the frisbee from the top the ladder? How come you circle today on your calendar? The last day of school is until tomorrow. Hmm? Oh, uh... uh I just made a mistake, I guess. Just a simple mistake. He circled today because today is prank day. What? Prank day? What is this prank day? I'll be checking your backpack. No, don't. Yep. Don't. Yep, Please, I will check don't. your backpack. It's if I just... see it, you are no, in trouble. I'll do the next picture. First game of the season, gents. Let's look alive. Remember what we worked 
and on in practice. Let's get this yo off of a that may have been the least inspired pregame speech I've ever heard. The first inning of the game of first season. Come on, Chester, little bingo. Until now, I've never seen a home run break this sound burial. I think it's going to be a good year. No, it's not. Extreme sports, extreme caution, extreme naughty, extreme wipeout. Extreme makeover. I'll take out the stitches out next week. Yep. Sigh. Woo. Found it. Zing. Dang. I need a shovel. Please. Are you chewing gum? Hmm? No. Then what's in your mouth? It's a uh, paper. Paper? Oh. Um, well, sometimes I chew on little scraps of notebook paper. It's. I don't know. It's a habit, I guess. Not only did she give me the attention, she sent me to the school council for face hackers. I don't know how to pronounce that. Examination. What? Watch it, guys. The puck's almost hit me. We're playing hockey, Ellen. What do you expect? I expect you to keep the puck on the ice, not to send it fly to the DL. We can't keep it all on the ice all the time. Yes, you can, and you will. No lefties. Got it? No lefties. Hey! Now uplifting, as she requested, the puck stayed on the ice. But give it up, Francis. You don't have a photographic memory. Yes, I do. Just close my eyes, and I can picture something I saw weeks ago, years even. Okay, then close your eyes. Done. What would you like me to picture? Click. <laughs> Like she never had an eraser break out of her mouth while chewing on pencil and then she spit out accidentally hit the class room's volunteer grin the mother in the head. You did it on purpose. I got a hundred on the math test. What did you get? What is the battle? I don't measure my worth based on my grade point average. I'm not the final on my score on some math test. Hey look, there's that kid who got a 36 on the math test. You're saying, hey, hey, it was a 38. And that's the end of the video. Make sure you like and comment and subscribe. I'll see you in part five in other videos. Bye.